The HAL Tejas MK2 2025 represents India's next leap in indigenous fighter jet technology, blending cutting-edge engineering with the country's growing aerospace confidence. Designed and developed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, this aircraft isn't just an upgrade, it's a complete evolution over the original Tejas, bringing a new level of performance, endurance, and combat capability. Let's begin with its overall design. The Tejas MK2 has a larger and more aerodynamic frame compared to its predecessor. It's built using advanced composite materials, which help reduce overall weight while maintaining incredible strength and radar stealth characteristics. The aircraft's sleek delta wing design and refined air intakes give it not only a sharper look but also improved airflow efficiency, enabling better stability and control during high-speed maneuvers. Every curve and surface of the Tejas MK2 has been carefully optimized to enhance both performance and stealth, making it harder for enemy radar systems to detect. Under the hood, the heart of the Tejas MK2 is the powerful GEF-414 engine, a significant upgrade from the earlier F-404 used in the Tejas MK1. This new power plant produces around 98 kilonewtons of thrust, giving the aircraft much higher acceleration and top speed capabilities. With this engine, the Tejas MK2 can reach speeds of over Mach 1.8 and climb rapidly to high altitudes, making it a formidable presence in both air-to-air -air combat and ground attack missions. The thrust-to-weight ratio has been finely tuned to allow superb agility, which is crucial in modern dogfights. Moving to performance, the Tejas MK2 is designed as a 4.5-generation fighter jet, placing it just a step below stealth-based fifth-generation aircraft. It can perform multiple roles, from air superiority to strike missions and even electronic warfare. The range has been extended significantly, now exceeding 1,500 kilometers on internal fuel, with the option for mid-air refueling to expand its operational reach even further. That means it can patrol longer, strike deeper, and stay in combat zones for extended periods. One of the key upgrades is in avionics and cockpit systems. The Tejas MK2 features a fully glass cockpit, integrating advanced digital flight controls and wide-area multi-function displays. Pilots have access to a helmet-mounted display system that allows them to target enemies just by looking at them, providing an instant edge in air combat. The fly-by-wire system has been upgraded for greater precision, ensuring that the aircraft remains stable even in extreme flight conditions. It's not just powerful, it's intelligent, with onboard computers continuously managing flight performance and systems in real time. In terms of weaponry, the Tejas MK2 is a true multirole fighter. It can carry a wide range of armaments, including air-to-air -air missiles like Astra and Derby, precision-guided bombs, anti-ship missiles, and even long-range standoff weapons. With a total of 11 hardpoints, an increase from the previous model, it offers far more flexibility in mission loadout. This means the same aircraft can switch roles quickly, from defensive interception to offensive strike missions, depending on the mission's demands. The radar system on the Tejas MK2 has also received a massive boost. It's equipped with an advanced AESA active electronically scanned array radar, capable of tracking multiple targets simultaneously with pinpoint accuracy. This radar not only detects enemies at long range but also resists jamming attempts from adversaries, ensuring reliable situational awareness in contested airspace. Combined with the electronic warfare suite and countermeasure pods, the Tejas MK2 can defend itself effectively against missile threats and radar. Lock-ons. When it comes to design innovations, the aircraft's modular structure deserves special mention. HAL has designed it for easier maintenance and faster turnaround times between missions. Panels and components are more accessible, reducing the downtime required for repairs or upgrades. This makes it cost-effective and operationally efficient, an essential factor for air forces operating under budget constraints. Safety and survivability have also been prioritized. The cockpit is armored to protect the pilot from ground fire and shrapnel, while the aircraft's electronic systems can automatically deploy countermeasures when a threat is detected. In emergencies, the zero-zero ejection seat ensures pilot safety even at zero altitude and zero speed. From a broader perspective, the Tejas MK2 represents India's growing independence in defense manufacturing. It reduces reliance on imported fighter jets and gives the Indian Air Force a homegrown solution that can be customized for specific needs.
Beyond national pride, this aircraft positions India as a competitive player in the global defense market. Several countries have already expressed interest in potential exports once production begins, recognizing the Tejas Mk2 as a cost-effective yet highly capable fighter option. In terms of aesthetics, the Tejas Mk2 carries a distinctly modern silhouette, aggressive yet elegant. The longer fuselage and redesigned canopy not only improve aerodynamics but also enhance pilot visibility. Its digital camouflage paint and stealth contours give it a futuristic appearance that matches its advanced capabilities. Overall, the HAL Tejas Mk2 2025 is more than just an upgrade, it's a symbol of how far India's aerospace engineering has evolved. It combines power, precision, and versatility in a compact, efficient platform that can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with some of the best 4.5-generation fighters in the world. With improved range, superior avionics, and powerful weapon systems, the Tejas Mk2 is ready to play a crucial role in strengthening India's air defense in the coming decade. Whether viewed from a technical or national pride perspective, the HAL Tejas Mk2 stands as a testament to innovation, resilience, and progress, a fighter designed for the future, built with the spirit of independence and excellence.